Now the first step is to select launch with DirectX 11. So when you launch the launcher, over here you can see launch with DirectX. Put a check over here and then you can start the game and then you can check. Still not working. The next step is to skip the launcher. Try launching the game from the game installation folder. Now for this, if you have the game on Epic Games launcher, uh, you can click on these three dots. Let me close the launcher. Close the launcher first. And then click on these three dots, manage, and then click on this folder. Go to the game installation folder. Over here you can see DNA game, open this folder. You can make a right click on this exe file, go to properties, go to this tab, put a check on the box which says run this program as an administrator, and then hit apply, click on OK. Make a double click, launch the game and then check. If that does not work, open EM folder, binaries, Win64, scroll down, find the game exe file, make a right click, go to properties, go to this tab, put a check on the box which says run this program as an administrator, hit apply, make a double click, launch the game from the game installation folder. So instead of launching the game from the launcher, you can launch the game from the game installation folder and then you can check. Now the next step is to disconnect the internet before opening the launcher. So when you launch the game, uh, before you launch the launcher, you can disconnect the internet. And like if, if internet is on, uh, you can just disconnect internet. If you're using ethernet cable, in that case, you can disconnect the, you can unplug the ethernet cable and then you can launch the launcher. And once the launcher is up and running, now you can connect to the internet or you can un uh, plug in the ethernet cable back to the computer and once it is connected now you can launch the game and then check still not working the next step is to perform clean installation of your graphics card driver so if you have nvidia card go to nvidia website if you have amd card go to amd website and then select your graphic card from the list make sure that you select your graphic card your operating system click on find and then whichever is the latest uh, geforce game ready driver on this page you can just uh, click on view and then you can click on download and then run this exe file run this exe file and then click on yes to allow click on ok and then click on agree and continue select custom option and then click on next and then put a check on the box which says perform a clean installation over here and then click on next after the clean installation restart your computer and after the system restart you can launch the game now if you have the amd graphic card select your graphic card Make sure that you select your graphic card. This is just an example. I don't have AMD. Now select your operating system and then you can install the latest. Download it, install it, restart your computer and then you can check. Still not working. Turn off or close VPN. So if you're using VPN, you can close it or turn it off. For many users, using the VPN has worked. So you can turn off. If that does not work, you can even turn on the VPN and then check. Next step is to allow the game exe file to antivirus program. So if you have any third party antivirus or if you're using Windows security, open Windows settings, privacy and security, Windows security, then click on virus and threat protection. Scroll down at the bottom, you will see manage ransomware protection. Click on it. Click on allow an app through control folder access. Click on yes to allow. Click on add an allowed app. Browse all apps. And then go to the game installation folder. So wherever the game install, if the game install in C drive, uh, program files for epic games launcher user you can open epic games and then open the game folder select the launcher open and then add an allowed app browser apps open the dna game select this exe file click on open and then browser apps open this em binaries win64 select this exe file click on open do the same thing in the control panel windows firewall so control panel system and security Windows Defender Firewall, allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall, change settings, allow another app, click on browse, go to the game installation folder, and then do the same thing. If you have the game from uh, like directly from the website, then you can open program file 686, select the game, do the same thing. You have to add all the game exe file to your Windows Firewall. DNA game, select this one add again browse all apps sorry open em binaries win64 select this exe file to open and then add once the game is added now you can launch the game and then check 
Similarly, if you have any third party antivirus like Avast, Do Not Own, Bitdefender, McAfee, whichever antivirus program you have, allow all the exe file to your antivirus program. The next step is to repair the game files. Now for this, you can go to launcher, click on these three horizontal lines and then click on repair now and then confirm. Once the repair is done, now you can launch the game and then check. Still not working, install Visual C++ file. Now for this, uh, you can go to Microsoft website and this install this, go to Microsoft official website and here you can see uh, Windows like Visual Studio files. You have to download this x86 and x64 and you have to run this exe file. Click on repair. If you see the repair option, click on yes to allow. If you see the install option, hit install. Download this x64 file as well. Run this exe file. Again, if you see the repair option, click on repair, click on install. If you see install, click on yes to allow and let the installation complete. Make sure both are installed. Once installed, restart your computer. And after the system restart, launch the game. Next, we should try installing the game from the Epic Games Launcher. Like if you have installed the game from the website, then you can you can find the game in Epic Games Launcher. And then when you search for the game, you will find the game in the list. You can find the game and try to install the game from Epic Games Launcher. So here you can see, you can uh, you can install the game. You can click on get, install it on Epic Games Launcher and then you can check. Now, if you have the game on Epic Games Launcher, then you can install the game from the website. So So you can search the game and then you can go to the official website. You can go to the official website and then you will see the download option on this website. Here you can see PC download. You can download the file. You can run this exe file, install it, and then you can check. So one of the steps shown in this video should help you to run the game successfully on your Windows computer. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.